depressed, frustrated, sad, confused. You want answer. Let's talk. Give me a message sa page ko sa Philippine Dating Coach. And you can have one-on-one -on -one coaching with Coach Base, your dating coach, and psychologist. Just please subscribe to my channel and hit the bell button. Gano ba kasi siya ka-cold? As in, gano siya kalamig? Ano bang uri yung pag-iwas yung ginagawa niya sa'yo? Actually, hindi mo na kailangan ng YouTube video para lamang ma-solve ang problema mo or malaman kung ano ang dapat mong gawin. During this epic time of your life, na biglang umiiwas yung ex mo for non-reason at all, you are trying to figure out what is really happening You are doing your very best just in order for you to know what's in that in that specific part. Bakit, bakit siya umiiwas? Bak, bakit niya ginagawa itong bagay na ito? What, what the hell is happening? And now what you are trying to do is just to compensate. Trying to chase, trying to make these things up para lamang maging okay or maging ayos kayo. But eventually, this is not going to work, it, work out like what you expected. That is why you don't need Any kind of YouTube video kapag sinabing umiiwas ang ex mo, I think it's just common sense. The answer is very, 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 very super common sense. Pabayaan mo. Kung gusto niya umiiwas, mas maganda, huwag mo ipakitang nasasaktan ka. Go ahead. Pabayaan mo. Let him do his thing. Kung doon siya, kung doon siya masaya, huwag ka masyadong possessive, huwag ka masyadong obsessed, huwag ka masyadong controlling Go ahead, pabayaan mo. And the consequences will not be on you. The consequences will be on her or on him. Siya yung magsasuffer ng consequences kapag na-realize mo na mas better ang life mo without him or without her. You will be having this kind of thought na, well, I think that will be better. Kung umiiwas ka or ano man, I don't, I don't really care. Pabayaan mo siya, give him or give her the space that you need. There's no technique that is really necessary. Walang technique na dapat i-apply, walang strategy na dapat i-apply, walang ganun. It's just allow him to do those things. And I know it's really hard na mag... Ang, ang hirap kapag ang i-advise ko lang sa'yo is mag-chill ka lang and just take care of yourself. Focus on happiness, on your own happiness and self-improvement. I know it's a lazy advice. I know that. I, I got you. But you don't have a choice. Just do those things that I have told you. Kung lumalayo siya, umiiwas siya, and then do not let him or let her na masira yung happiness mo because of that pag-iwas. And dahil lang umiiwas siya, sira na araw mo, sira na buwan mo. I think it is much better if you are going to focus on your present time. Kung ano yung ginagawa mo, kung sa trabaho siya umiiwas, kung sa chat siya umiiwas, kung magkapitbahay lang kayo, iniiwas ang kapa niya, kung sa group of friends, dun siya umiiwas. Whether nasaan ka man, nasaan ka man, lupalop ng mundo, iniiwasan ka niya, then... Allow him to do that. Pabayaan mo siya. And do not let this person break your happiness. Huwag mong hayaang i-break niya yung happiness na meron ka or sirain niya, ruining your day. Just focus on yourself. I know it's a hard advice. It's a lazy advice na sabihin na maging masaya ka lang because I know how really hard it is. But we don't have a choice. That's the only option that you can do. And don't worry. After na in-invest mo yung time mo for happiness and your own safe, own self, nagbigay ka ng momentum sa sarili mo, hindi mo inaya, hinayaan na itong babae na ito is going inside your head or itong lalaki na ito is going inside your head, you did not let that to happen, then that will be the time that you will be rewarded. And what is the reward? The reward is the attraction. Because once you do that, you are showing him or her Now you are a very attractive person. Because you know how maturity works. You are really, really mature enough to understand that there are times na iiwas, iwas, 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 lamig, lamig, lamig. Pero pinabayaan mo siya, then that's maturity works. Probably turn off siya sa iyo sa ibang part. Natuturn off siya siguro sa attitude mo, financial status mo, sa looks mo, or anything like that. Marami siyang bagay na kinatuturn off sa iyo. Pero isang bagay ang ikakaturn on niya sa iyo na maaaring magbaliktad ng lahat ng sitwasyon at maaaring bumalik siya sa'yo because of that turning on point. Saan siya turn on? Doon sa pag-handle mo sa sarili mong happiness. 
maybe you are financially broke right now, maybe you are uh, physically not good, maybe meron kang trouble, maybe may mga attitude ka na nakatawa-tawa, maybe com- comedic ka or you're kind of weird to her. But this is actually the right time para i-counter mo yun. And what is that? Ano yung pang-counter na yun? You're driving your own happiness. Once na napansin ng ex mo na kaya mong kontrolin ang sarili mong happiness, yung pagka-turn on niya dun sa, sa ability mo to control yourself, kaya niyang i-cover lahat ng mga nakaka-turn off na sides mo. Kasi pinapakita mo dun na you are mature enough, reliable, and you are emotionally controlled. Hindi ka uto-uto ng sitwasyon at hindi ka nagpapadala sa sitwasyon. And that will pay respect. Kaya maging happy ka lang during the situation. This, th- this is not an idiotic action. Huwag ka This is not an idiotic action. The idiotic action is yung kadalasan ginagawa ninyo, yung kapag iniiwasan, nasasaktan. That's a very idiotic action. But if you will do something like happiness, you are pretending na, yeah, yeah, that's fine. I don't really give a shit because I can control my emotion. And this person doesn't have any access inside my mind. Right? But if you are really looking forward na magkabaligan pa kayo, give us a message sa Philippine Dating Coach and let me give you one-on-one advice. Thanks for watching.